I used to call Rosa fluffy potatoes, whereas the kittens fluffy marshmallows. I had literally never done dogs before Rosa. I saw this post and it said, hey, urgent bottle feeder needed. They cannot go to a home with other dogs. Most people that foster puppies have dogs and puppies of their own. That pretty much cuts out everybody who's going to be a puppy bottle feeder in the first place. I messaged and I said, hey, how different is it to bottle feed a puppy than it is a kitten? She's like, it's almost the same. It's super similar. I think you'd be good at it. So I bring them home. Kittens are kind of born with this distrust of you until they learn that you are a safe person and you're the one feeding them and caring for them. Whereas Rosa, straight away, she was just like, oh, person, you're my person. I'm gonna love you, I'm gonna get excited when I hear you. I'd go in and like wake her up and her little butt would start wiggling. feeding every two hours overnight and you feed it to them in the exact same same positions everything it's just a size difference rosa by like week three was like mm, i don't want this bottle anymore i want some real food and i'm like okay i'm like she's got this like we're gonna do this watching their development you know puppies i would say develop a lot quicker than kittens do kittens there's definitely no coordination for like at least the first week or so i mean they're just kind of like these little cute wiggly worms that kind of squirm around again everywhere rosa by like a week and a half she was walking she got her cute little belly that kind of runs along the ground eyes pretty much open right around the same time hearing i do believe develops earlier in puppies than it does in kittens in terms of kittens like their ears are folded in and you watch their ears unfold with her her ears were how they still are now you know she had these cute little fluffy ears and it's pretty much how they stayed the kittens start playing earlier, which is funny to me. Rosa, she really didn't start being interested in like any toys or anything. She was like four and a half to five weeks old. Whereas I've got three week old kittens in the room that have toys in there that they enjoy batting around. And I think that having been able to experience that has definitely taught me a lot of things. I kind of look at rescue with like these little kitten blinkers on and you know there are puppies in need too and if you're a kitten foster and your rescue posts for a puppy, do it. Take, take that opportunity to learn something new. I definitely still shed a couple of tears when I you know left her but most of the kittens I get are so fragile that it really is a labor of love. And Rosa was a labor of love, but in a different sense. I actually kept all of my puppy supplies, so I have pretty much everything ready that comes up again. Like, comment, and subscribe.